You think it's a joke? <laughs> you think it's a joke? When I told you that countries and states have started joining Biafra, you think it's a joke? Listen to what Mazi Samanaba said. I made it. Almost missed my flight. Going back to base. I have added something very significant to the liberation of Biafra. Something significant have been added to the restoration of the Biafran state. <laughs> now, watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Breaking news. Asian Tiger Nations of Indonesia joins Biafran liberation. We are moving. Asian Tiger Nation, we are moving. You see, this thing that uh, people usually say about the restoration of Biafra, let me break it down to you. There is no reason why we must fight to the end because if we watch the 3 million people that, uh, you know, was offed by the Nigerian government and international countries because we demanded for a nation of our own, we must again understand the most important things that we should perceive and by perceiving all those stuff we can throw ourselves to that very point where every one of us must be noticeable and that is just the basic truth. Yes. I'm being honest with you. So, we have become more reincarnating and throwing more punch. And nobody, I repeat, nobody would again in their own negative way put biafra under their buttocks so indonesia their forces will be joining 500 forces will be joining for the immediate liberation of biafra and that is what i'm saying that if victory is not recorded then victory will not be known there's no two ways about it. If victory is not recorded, then victory will not be known. Let's get this fact straight. Our world is evolving and revolving and we must equally help ourselves to throw this very signature so that we are not going to fade at once. What matters more is that we have not gotten somebody who is ready to carry that cross. Because Biafra needs somebody who is strong, not somebody who is weak. And that is just it. We only need somebody who must stand with us in every area, at every point. What do you expect? So we are we are moving with maximum speed and most importantly our understanding are now getting more wide. And whether they like it or not, more reasons and more reasons and more reasons will be shown in the coming future. It doesn't matter who is offended. But what matters more is that we cannot, in any sense, look at them who want to destroy. So more things have been added, significant things have been added to the restoration and actualization of Biafra. Wait for it. Yeah. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. It is a good news and a wrap up. <laughs> There's what we call Dragon Marine. Dragon Marine. This is the Biafran Liberation uh, uh, part or section of the Marine soldiers. The military Marine has bombed two zoo vessels that is supplying oil illegally 
two zoo vessels, take down more than 20 zoo terrorists and two fighter boats has been taken out by the dragon marine hear the news in details we are moving with a speed that most of us must understand the great point this is one thing i must say that we're already going to that very point where victory must be assured it must be reassured it must be seen and it must be productive you see we cannot uh take ourselves for granted because the very moment we see this whole situation we are only going to sit back and watch the difference and that's just the truth of the matter we're only going to sit back and watch the difference the motive the motion and how far we can go there's no two ways about it so we have had people who will be controlling the air who will control the sea and who is going to control the land i think the m16 and m26 is back to biafra land and some of you thought we are joking don't worry a lot of things will be unraveled in the nearest future <laughs> a lot will be unraveled in the nearest future it will be unveiled in the nearest future but for now two vessel powerful vessel illegal vessel that has been taken over biafra land has been taken down by biafra dragon marine the dragon marine the dragon marine you know a few days ago that someone ever warned about uh, the bakasi those in the bakasi area who have been taking territories of our lands and of our of our own heritage they must pay this very sacrifice to the very end and that is why i must say that the victory we share we perceive must be guaranteed in full course you get the point in full course so as we continue to conserve every areas of our lives as we continue to push for this very final moment let's again look at ourselves and reconsider ourselves in a greater height you understand i reconsider ourselves in a greater height there is no two ways about it one thing is very important yeah, their friends have done a very great job in the past to communicate and do the needful because as long as things will be carried the way it should be carried then we must engage ourselves to the final theory so as we win victoriously push victoriously to the promised land we must at the same time equally understand that nothing can stop biafrans again the biafran marine dragon marine is doing their job so bakasi is actually meant for biafrans it is owned by biafrans they use it to settle people who came to fight against biafra how can you use our land to settle people that came to fight us that is evil that is demonic that shows how desperate the zoo republic can go to see that biafra does not rise but we're already rising with maximum speed ah they are seeing it and they are shocked they are amazed they are surprised but let's get ourselves together because at the end of the day every formidable force will be recorded the way it should be recorded and that's the only way we can finish out every of the theory so there's no two ways about it victory must be reassured victory must be recorded and we must continue to win